you could DM my account. My DM six figures and I'm counting. Nine figures was the goal till I hit the E. Niggas ain't living so bury my Willie off the When I die, put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap till this nigga on my face. Let it slap with the bass. I used to save hoes with a mask and a cake. Now I'm like, nah, love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money out in cave. I'm about to cook and I'm about to bring you guys along with me. And it's not about to be no talking. I'm going to just show y'all what I'm using and what I'm doing. And yeah, I'm going to just let it run through. So, yeah. <laughs> Yo, what is it? Come on. <laughs> hey, get Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, I'll do my hair. But yeah, let me set y'all up. Mm -hmm. Hey, you guys. So, I'm going to first start off by cutting up the vegetables. As you can see, I started doing the orange ones, and I'm cutting up bell peppers now. Then, um, next, I will be cutting up the onions. These are all the vegetables that I cut up to saute to make my spaghetti pasta. So, and, and I forgot, I also added the red pepper as well. Red brings out the most flavors. So next you want to add butter to a pan. You need butter to saute your vegetables. So right now we're just going to add um, a couple of scoops of butter. And then now we are going to add our vegetables into the pan. So it can start sauteing. So yeah, let's watch this cook, you guys. And I'll tap back in in a sec. TTYL. <laughs> sauteing the vegetables I feel like when you saute it and not put it in raw your food is extra tasteful I feel like the food is more seasoning and it tastes much better and also I'm adding garlic herbs to the batter because it makes the food just ah, smack delicious but yeah I add a little seasoning to give the um, sauteed vegetables extra taste so that's what we doing we gonna add some tony sasserin in that thing and yeah facts y'all i use tony sasserin for everything i mean it's the best to me the best seasoning y'all y'all see that stuff looking all nice and good we got it going your girl can really throw down in the kitchen yeah i can really go so yeah we about to get into this next thing 
which is these strips we about to just season the strips and you guys just watch along i hope you guys enjoy these voiceovers and things of that sort i don't do this much but i'm getting more into it creating better content for you guys so yeah we getting into it so watch your girl season the strip and y'all this food was delicious it was so 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 good and this is this was my first time making spaghetti pasta and it came out great so yeah y'all stay tuned <laughs> So I always season my shrimp before I put it in a skillet because I need seasoning to marinate inside of the shrimp while it waits for um, the vegetables to get sauteed so it's seasoning properly. So and I also add as I go, you know, I basically look at my food to see if I need more and things of that sort and I add and add when the, the um, shrimp is not defrosted. I mean, thawed out. Yeah, when they are not thawed out, that's when I add more because um, the seasoning tends to fall off the shrimp when they are hard and cold and have all that ice on it. So it's not really getting all its seasoning when it's not thawed out. So that's why I add more. But yeah, I just add those. Then I add um, a little butter on top so it can start to cook, steam. So I basically steam those shrimp for a little while, then I mix in the rest of the food with it. So yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> added the spaghetti in the hot water I let it sit now I'm going in and I'm adding the crawfish tails to the shrimp so I like to normally mix all these together get all that juice and that seasoning in together and start like that to make my base of my sauce so yeah I'm just about to cook these crawfish tails and I also keep adding butter to make my juice so I'm just about to keep going so you guys Keep watching.
And this what I did off camera. So I started um, adding my heavy whip and I also added some mild cheddar cheese to the top. My camera had actually died, that's why I didn't add those extra steps. And I ended up recording off of my phone. So if the footage looked different, that is why. So yeah, I just added um, heavy whip and some mild cheddar cheese right now. And I'm going to let that thicken up. And then I'm going to let it cook some more. And my noodles is already ready. And as you can see, they can just sit in there. Sit in there, ready for the sauce to be added. So now y'all see me adding the sauce into the spaghetti. And y'all, when I tell you this stuff was buzzing, like this stuff was amazing. It was so, 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 so good. Y'all have to try it. So right now, I'm going to just go in and add um, more cheese. And y'all, my camera died. Ah. And I also made a cake. So I wanted to show you guys this nice um, velvet and vanilla swirl cake it was so good so yeah this all y'all got because my camera died so let's continue watching this is actually the next day as well it's the next day okay i'm about to wash my face really really quick i got like five minutes five minutes before i have to go The DT Beauties. Um, today is Blogmas 13, and um, today is my son's birthday. We got drill in the cut. Okay. Say hey. So um, 
right now we about to go get I wanna go oh say hey Kai <laughs> we got Jakai she stay at home from school today because she um, isn't feeling too good so she rather with us but right now we about to go get my son um some cupcakes for his birthday for school we about to go take up some cupcakes for school and um Yeah, then I don't know what's next, but I'm going to come back when I figure out what we're about to do. Oh, um, I'm probably about to go to my mother-in-law house to let my sister take down my hair. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Why did I? Oh, I'm mad. They only got these. They only have these. Okay, we just gonna have to. We gonna do them kind. Yeah, we just getting um a cookie cake and we got these cupcakes. We got these cupcakes. So it's Christmas cupcakes. <sighs> okay, I got the cookie cake and that's what I need. But sweaters. I mean, I <laughs> yeah, as I was um, rolling up on this guy, he was looking like, why the fuck you got that camera pointed at me? I, was like, I don't know if y'all gonna see him, but anywho, I had got this cookie cake for JB, and the handwriting was hideous. It was horrible, and I hated it, so I didn't give him that. I ended up giving it to Jarrell, and I ended up going to the store and getting him a real two-layer cake. And I'm getting him another cake on the 16th, which is Friday, 
for his actual gathering. So yeah, I just thought I should stop in and say that 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 cake was horrible. I mean, that handwriting was horrible. Oh my car. Okay, you guys. Um I wanted to jump in a chat on the topic of what's her name? Glorilla? When she was talking about the 50-50 thing of going to have with your dude 50-50 on bills if y'all together. Um, I believe you should go have with your dude 50-50. I feel like 50-50 makes everything balanced and equal and you know it don't make nobody in a relationship feel like less than or feel like they doing too much for you things like that but i believe if your man had way more money than you then he could pay the bills like yeah and i believe if your man did have way more money than you he would want to pay the bills like he wouldn't have you out here struggling so yeah i believe you should go 50 50 like What you doing, girl? She's just jiggling those chips. But, um, we about to head out to my um, mother-in-law house. We about to go to Jakai's granny house. Let me put my seatbelt on. But, yeah, I feel like... I feel like, yeah, all... If y'all make a about the same amount of money or uh, y'all make equal amount of money y'all should go 50 50 like it's a 50 50 relationship that's what i feel personally for me but if we can do more that's cool too but we should split so nobody don't feel like they doing too much or uh, you know nobody don't feel like you owe them nothing uh, stuff like that, you know, for petty people in toxic relationships, not for good, stable relationships. But yeah, I just want to jump in the chat and talk about that. I'm with Glorilla. I thought I should stop in and just chat about that and, you know, say how I feel about that situation. But, Checking back in. School back, Jakai. School back. 
So I'm checking back in. Um, we just made a stop. Say my name. Hmm? Say my name. They know your name. They know that it's Jaka. <laughs> but um, anywho, I'm checking back in. We about to go ahead to the store and pick up a few more gifts for JB's birthday today. Um, we not doing much. She not having a birthday party. Um, we gonna just do a little family gathering. And do some dinner Girl, sit back, sit back fast. But, um, yeah, we just gonna do like a, um, family gathering. And, um, we gonna go to Jumping Rail and stuff like that. And have a little fun. An intimate gathering. Nothing big, nothing too much. I just want to do like a, um, a couple of decorations for him back home. So, <coughs> so yeah. So, yeah, that's what we're about to do. We're about to head to um, a few stores and pick up a couple of gifts. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's what we're about to do. Sit back, little girl. We see y'all when we get the store. Right, Mama? Yes. <laughs> That's right. We'll see y'all when we get to the store. Tell them peace. peace. Oh, what's up, you guys? As you can see, I am back home. My hair is a mess. I will show you guys, but. I'm not going to do that. Um, I'm going to have to start wrapping gifts for the kids. As you can see, I'm tired of shit. I am tired. But uh, I'm going to have to start wrapping gifts. Me and Jerrell. Because as you can see, the tree is... Pretty much empty. Okay. The tree is pretty much empty. Nothing is there. So we is about to start wrapping gifts. Okay. So I can't really show the gifts that shows what it is, so I'm gonna wrap those. And you guys gonna see me wrap the ones that's in like brown boxes or stuff like that. Just some shopping I started doing. Um, it's not much, but it's a start. Happy Vlogmas! This is the 14th. And sorry, you guys, I missed two days or a day. I don't really know, but. Like I was saying, a lot of stuff went on yesterday, and yeah, so we here now, and I'm gonna do my hair today. I don't know what I'm gonna do to it, but I'm gonna do something to it. But anywho, we about to start um, rapping. We about to start rapping. Yeah, I got my window open. My window's open. Just to let some light. I'm back. Do it, sit and watch me wrap these gifts i wanted to jump in on a topic of speaking about megan the stallion and tori lanes and kelsey harris i believe that's her last name um this is a big shit show like y'all what is going on like i'm sitting on um my phone instagram reading all these um 
prosecutors, pitches, and DAs, and lawyers, and things of that sort, and I'm blown away. Like, somebody needs to pay. I don't care who pay. I don't care if Kelsey gotta go to Tory Lanez, cause she clearly is covering for him. Like, oh girl, go your ass to jail. Take that immunity from her and send her ass to jail. Tell me in the comments what you guys think. I know yeah. for a fact Kelsey is covering. Like now, all of a sudden, you I mean, forgot. You don't remember you when you just said it two months ago. All of these things, all of a sudden, you forgot. Oh, I can't remember. I didn't see blood. I didn't see her get shot. Girl, he paid you. He paid you. You've been knowing this man for five minutes. If they both did screw each other, like, girls stick together. Like, a nigga wouldn't do that over a female. He would not do that over a female. Like, girl, bye. I'm not about to go do no time or get in trouble over no nigga. So, let me know what y'all think in the comments. Drop it down below. What you guys think? Because I think Kelsey should do some time. I think Tory Lane shot her. And she's covering. Because he paid her. For her lawyers, he paid for everything, baby. So, that's why she's saying what she's saying. Now, you got amnesia. Girl, bye. But let me know down below what y'all think. Ain't about to die with no money I don't gave I was on top when that sleep meant a lot Still on top like I'm scared of the drop Still on top when these niggas wanna swap Niggas wanna swap like it's all sitting box I don't wanna change cause I'm good where I'm at Mom ties so I'm always good where I'm at Word of Junior, Jazzy, Baby J Tell them what I got Okay, I finished wrapping up that give Right, comment down below What you guys rate this give? How good that I wrap it? Um, how precise is my rapping? How crisp is my corners in my tape? Let your girl know in the comments. But keep watching, TTYL. Dead broke is in your nigga DNA. Ricky Smile is indicated with me. Little nigga, just another state case. Very now, motherfucker, chase bank, trying to bounce. Gotta count on my allowance. You niggas push it, so I gotta rebound it. A nigga tripping like I got a Z and dollars. Got the trap jumping like time. When I feet down, then I'm out. Then I never talk about it. The homie squad, but we all smoke the loudest. Rich niggas in the middle being modest. Cause the way I do my deals, never treated like I bought a smoke house. Who bury my with me? Off the When I die, put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap with this nigga on my face. Let it slap with the bass. I used to save hoes with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money, I done gave it. I love you, Polly. Yo, the Thank you.
catch him in a hit. So, the tree is not lit, but we got the presents. We got some of the presents, just a couple of presents for today. And I gotta get boxes for other things and stuff like that. And more everything, but this is some of the gifts that we have wrapped for today. And the tree isn't lit up or anything. So yeah. But yeah. This is what we did for today. So we finished that and yeah, the kids are still at school. I still don't know what I'm about to do to my hair, but I'm about to go figure it out. So this will end out the vlog. I want to thank you guys for watching. Continue watching. Go watch my last videos. Support, like, comment, and subscribe, you guys. This is a family channel, and we coming hard. Happy Vlogmas. And I really love you guys, and thanks for all the support. And don't forget to go subscribe. Thank you.